Hey guys, Fearsome Rubber Ducky here with a match versus Privateer as a Musketeer. This is one of several matches. I picked this particular map because I use Ratbeard a lot. Um, I This is a very good example match of how Ratbeard should be used. Now, I made a few mistakes, and so did he, but um, I picked this particular match just because of uh, the companion Ratbeard. I wanted to show how that companion could be used effectively. As I noticed that a lot of people don't use Ratbeard, especially Musketeers. So, yeah, so he slows and he bombs as expected. Um, and move over there. Keep moving up. There's no reason to fort quite yet. He could charge his Nelly in this case, but I would kill his Nelly easily. Purge and all. So he knows better. I'm just faking that I have Purge right now. There we go. It's going to go and get rid of that Ghost Whale right there. I'm going to fort. I'm going to keep moving up. I'm going to use the agility buff. I'm going to burn that overwatch because it's not really going to be useful. One of the really great uses of Ratbeard is he can kind of block Buccaneers and come in Buccaneers. Like, he, if he were to fort spam that goal, I would just move my Ratbeard in the way so that he couldn't actually get to my Musketeer units. You just make sure you put Max Dodgy and you put Hold the Line 3 and Repel Borders 3, and there you go. Perfect counter to any incoming Buccaneer. Puts that little Strength buff on. I'm going to put Nox right there so I can move up next turn and chain on his Privateer. Now, Privateers have hardly any agility at all, so they're incredibly easy to chain. I just really like it when Privateers bring Emmett versus me, as if the stun is, is any good, really. <laughs> and I'm not one of those Musketeers that usually brings Nausicaa, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm happy whenever a privateer brings Emmett. Well, the Nox kicked in and it stopped the rush. Thank goodness. Girl is dead. But just to make sure, I'm going to bomb. I'm going to reduce Nelly. I'm going to use Exeter to make sure that Girl is dead. He's dead. Here comes the reduce. That will cut Nelly's agility by half and cause Chantel to chain like crazy and possibly kill. Uh, miscalculation slightly. Oh well, as long as I get it down to Emmett and Ratbeard, I should say, um, Exeter and Ratbeard versus, uh, his pirate <laughs> and, uh, Emmett, then I've won. So he puts a VA on his, um, on his, um, Nausicaa. Here's what I do with Ratbeard, because there's like a big cluster of bombs and traps. I use this knockback, bam, bam, bam. There we go. Exeter finishes him off. So that's another use of Ratbeard. His reduce, his knockback, as you saw, was very useful in killing Nausicaa right there. And it's and it's also a way to stop the Goro Rush, as I mentioned earlier. So, yeah. He still has that super left, and he's on Tide, so he's going to do extra damage, which is awesome. I'm going to go ahead and take out his Emmet right now. Surprised it didn't chain more, considering I was on a buff. Well, he actually clutched it. that 
mini um mini agility buff so I can chain more. Okay, there we go. Okay, that was a smart movie, forts. Alright, and I'm going to fort and I'm going to move my rat beard back so he's out of range of Emmett. There we go. Press done. Some more damage off on him. And he realizes that Rat Beard's still important, so he uses an assassin strike. There we go, Rat Beard's dead. He did his job. Well done. Going to try and get some chains on him because, you know, privateers, as I said earlier, don't have much agility at all. Alright, no chains, but oh well. I still got this. It's just us and the otters at this point. I'm gonna put a mini on Exeter. I'm going to slow him. He's got that um, large group heal right there. And move out right here. He's probably going to move behind the pillar. Let's just see what he does. If he does, I'll just Inferno shot both of them or something like that. Yep, uh, that's a good space or a good spot for an Inferno shot right there. I'm going to get some good damage off. Bam. <clears throat> now he's going to move further back and I'm going to block him off with bombs. Hopefully. And yeah, that looks like a good place. I might be in range of Emmett. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm in range of Emmett. Why did I do that? <laughs> oh well. And I'm going to move up. Have bombs to cover, and I have editor, so why not? He's probably going to move to the side. Yep, he does. Right. And I can still hit Emmett, so that's good. Going to go ahead and heal. Alright, we'll see what he does next. He's going to go ahead and revive his Emmett, I bet. And he does. Not a horribly bad move. Alright, I'm going to trigger his overwatch. I'm going to go ahead and put that VA on him. And I have a Valor's shield um, on, so that means that it counts towards his Valor's armor because I put it on first. Okay, he heals. Yeah, that's a little trick. Um, you want to put the Valor's um, armor on after the Veiler's Fortress or the Veiler's Shield, that way the Veiler's Shield or Veiler's Fortress counts towards the Valor's armor. So it does reduce damage on the Veiler's armor, which is really nice. But yeah, that sequence is important. Alright, stuns Emmett, good boy. Go ahead and use that Kraken's armor because Emmett is practically dead. So, mm. I can't hit him with that, so I burn it. Let's trigger his witch hunt. Nope, it didn't work. Oh well, got a rather nice chain anyway. And he revives. There we go. Soul Shroud, you're awesome. The reason why I win most of my matches versus Privateer. No, I'm not even lying, that's actually true. Because privateers love to use Soul Shroud. Watch me get stunned. Okay, I didn't get stunned. That was surprising. Go ahead and use that. Mm 
My goodness, wow. <laughs> well, that was a clutch. Misses because of Overwatch. I'm just going to go ahead and do that dodge reduce so that Exeter can hit. That wasn't enough damage. Let's see what he does now. This point you might be calling it GG. Okay, well he kills my otter. Alright, so I just canister shot him. <laughs> he tried to hide behind that pillar. Well anyway, that was GG. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope that the, the rap beer tricks that I showed you in this video are helpful. Hope to see y'all using that and the spar in the future. Uh, more musketeers using rap beer because he's really an underrated companion. Um, so yeah, th that's it for this video. Um, I'll be trying to record some more Musketeer videos. Uh, people have been asking me to do Witch Doctor since they think that's the class that's uh, at the greatest disadvantage in this meta, and I would actually have to agree. But uh, you can still play Witch Doctor pretty well. Um, so anyway guys, that is it for this video, and peace out for now.